Daybreak is all local all morning long, and every Saturday we highlight a local company together with our partners at Indiana Grown. We have Vicki Boyles here with Boyles Family Farm Cattle this morning. Thanks for being here up Thank early you. with us. Thank you. So we were chatting in the break. You guys raise Wagyu cattle. Yes. What is that? Explain a little bit. Wagyu is a Japanese breed, and it's very slow growing. It takes about 30 months to get up to processing weight. Um, they're... Our cows are pretty gentle, they're pretty calm, they're pasture raised, meaning that they're out and grazing in the grass. I think in the, the video that I sent, you mm -hmm. can see that. Um, the one cow that's right there in front of me though is a Holstein, however. Okay. <laughs> is not a Wagyu. Um, she's my guard cow. A <laughs> guard uh, cow, I love that. <clears throat> she is. And um, the Wagyu has, their meat is known for a high amount of marbling, which is, Typically, we think of that as fat, and it is, but it's good fat versus bad fat. So this is a healthier version Absolutely. of cattle for you than when it's you get it. It's the only beef that's healthy for you, wow. and it tastes good. So how would you guys get into doing this? You're in Mitchell. Yes. Um, so you've been farming for a while, but doing this since when? Uh, 2017, 2018. It's a very slow process just because they're slow, so slow growing, but that's what also helps with the marbling. What piqued your interest to want to grow this and raise this cattle? Well, it's a high quality beef, and it's just kind of one of those things that if you're going to reach for something, reach for the top. Mm -hmm. I agree with so. that. Okay, so th is this you with the guard cow then? Um, or is this one of the Wagyu? It's hard to this, see in our video. Actually, here. this is primarily we have right now, but we're transitioning. Our cows are Simangus. They're black, but the Wagyu is not known for having a lot of milk. Okay. The Simangus has a great amount of milk. Oh. Being the Simmental combined with the Angus. Um, whoop, there was one. There. <laughs> it, yeah, it's a little tough to see. I, you're educating me because certainly while I've gone to restaurants and it's like, oh, you can have the, the Angus or like upgrade to a Wagyu, I never really knew what it meant. But the basics of it is this is better for you if you're Absolutely. getting a burger or getting a steak or yes. whatnot. Um, where can people find your guys's product? We have uh, a sell out of the farm at times, which is down in Mitchell. Oh, I just want to say this is the cutest, sweetest video. That <laughs> little calf was about three days premature, and there's Dottie, my Holstein gar cow. Aww. But I bottle fed her twice a day. Wow. For three days. Oh my gosh. And uh, because she couldn't stand, she couldn't nurse. Yeah. Oh. And she did beautifully. And that's your guard cow. Then, that is there. Dottie. I love yes. that. Dottie. Yes. <laughs> um, okay, but sorry. Back to where people can buy the. <laughs> that's your okay. Wagyu. That's fine. Um, we have an office that my husband's transitioning to, just north of Mitchell. It's a little red building. We refer to it as the annex. I don't have set hours there, just because it's just my husband and I right now mm -hmm. managing the farm, and um, so dealing with the weather and equipment issues. Right now we have about 90 acres of hay on the ground. So when you and I are finished today, that we are heading south quickly. Oh, yeah. Get some things rolling. Get some things rolling. Mm -hmm. uh, and then any current specials people can know about? We're offering our ground beef at $6 a pound, which oh, is cool. really pretty cheap. Um, it's good stuff. All right. Well, thank you so much. We'll chat in an hour. Okay.